Stephen, it was great talking with you. I just want to show you this unit we were referring to. This is the medical generator unit. See it's high level sterilization. You can see the seals on there from the KFDA and CDC. This is Nail Clean Technology. It's from Japan. I'm sorry, from Korea, South Korea. This is for high level sterilization and for endoscopy and other medical equipment. But it produces a very high level disinfectant solution. And this unit comes in through, I get a water from the main city water. There's a filtration here that goes through, the filter of the water that comes with the machine. On the back of the machine, give you an idea here, there's an adjustable valve that you can adjust up and down. You basically turn it up. If you want to get a little bit lesser PPM on your solution, or you can go down if you want to get a little bit more on a higher level of PPM on your solution. But there's really not a lot to working this machine to generate the solution. You, this is, a, I'll show you this inside, this, you'd lift this back. This is our brine tank. Brine tank is, holds the water and the, and the salt. This takes two cups of salt. You fill the water up to, to this point. This is a mark right here. Fill up with water and you use the salt. I'm going to add some water and salt to this unit before I use it. But this is what we use. It's a kosher salt. Something you can pick up at Costco, Sam's, or any stores like that, or grocery stores as well. Cost a couple bucks a box. We got salt. So, anyway, you'll add water, fill this up with salt. We use two cups. This is our cup that we would use to mix our salt. We pour it in through and we basically take this out, fill this up with water and salt solution and shake it up really well like this, just to dissolve your salt and water. I'm gonna go ahead and use the water tank from my other machine. Save some time. So this is one we made up. This is our home unit. It looks very similar. I'm gonna take this out and put this in this tank just so I can save a little bit of time. I'm gonna close it up and I'll hit the power button here. And the other buttons are the clean button. I said well, about once a month, you'll hit the button to clean. And you get a timer here. But you just to turn it on, you hit the, hit the disinfect button. So we're gonna power it on. And then we hit on. And we're starting the producing of our hypercourt acid solution. So that's it. You can take your buckets underneath here, fill them up with water. And you can have a attachment set up on your sink with a, with, a, with a magnet if you want, or you can have a dispenser set it up. That's your solution. So it comes out at a pretty good pace. It's about a, not quite a gallon a minute. You put your gallon solution here, sprayer, or whatever you want to use. And that's how that works. So you have indicators on the front of the machine where it's high level, high, medium, and low. And this will, will go back and forth between 20s to 40s. And it's got a timer for five minutes. So it'll automatically it'll shut off after five minutes as this machine will start getting hot. I'll give you an idea here. I'll just want to do a quick test on the solution. Let me turn this off. And we use a little tester here to test your ppm this one here just goes up to 500 I'll give you a little test sample here and then we just swab that in and you'll see this is coming out at Excess of 500, sorry. Let's see here, that's in excess of 500. Okay. So that's how this works. The solution was all clear. It has a slight scent to it. And that's how it works. It's very simple to operate. So, like I said, there's nothing to it. 
to hook this up. It would take you a matter of probably half an hour of time. So, any questions? That's this unit, and this is the other home unit here. He said, and this one, the medical units at retail six thousand, and this one runs twenty three fifty. And this is more for home use for fish and seafood, fruits and vegetables, dishware, utensils, towels, sinks, restrooms, drains. This one you can, like I said, spray around on food. This one you would not spray on food. This is more like a high level disinfecting. Thanks, appreciate the opportunity to work with you, and uh, look forward to being able to help you provide the right solution to your community. Thank you.